हेलो फ्रेंड्स इन दिस क्वेश्चन ए हाइपरोला पासिस थ्रू द पॉइंट पी रूट टू कोमा थ्री रूट थ्री एंड फोक एट प्लस माइनस टू इज गिवन सो सो इफ वी रिमेंबर द बेसिक हाइपरबोला इक्वेशन इज दैट इज एक्स स्क्वायर अपोन ए स्क्वायर माइनस वाई स्क्वायर अपोन बी स्क्वायर दिस इक्वल टू वन सो वट वी कैन डू वी नो दैट दिस पॉइंट इज पास दिस हाइपरबोला इज पास थ्रू दिस पॉइंट दैट मीन्स दिस पॉइंट विल लाइ ऑन दिस सो वी कैन पुट इट हेयर सो रूट टू स्क्वायर विल बी टू ए स्क्वायर माइनस थ्री बी स्क्वायर इक्वल टू वन इफ यू क्रॉस मल्टीफ्लाई इट यू विल गेट रूट टू बी स्क्वायर माइनस थ्री ए स्क्वायर इक्वल टू ए स्क्वायर बी स्क्वायर दिस इज वन ऑफ द इक्वेशन नॉट लेट सोल्व फोकाई वी नो दैट फोकाई इज एट ऑलवेज एट ए सो वी कैन राइट ए इक्वल टू टू If you remember that is anticipatory relationship for hyperbola that is a a square e square minus a square. So we know that a is equal to two. That's why it will be two square minus a square b square. So b square plus a square will be equal to four. This is our second relationship. And now this is two equations. We can solve a b. So what we are doing just we are putting A in terms of B, B in terms of A here. So twice of B square will be four minus A square. Four minus A square minus three A square equal to A square B square. So it is minus two A square minus three A square equal to A square B square. So what we can do? Sorry, this is also B square. So four minus A square. So it will come out eight minus five a square. Now this is four a square minus a four. So we can write a four four nine a square plus eight equal to zero. So if you factorize it, you will get eight a square minus eight a square minus one. So if you are getting either a square equal to eight. Or a square equal to one. So, if a square equal to eight, then a will be approx two root two. So, so a, we know that a is our two. So, if a is two root two, then e will be our one upon root two. That is less than one, which cannot be possible because in hyperbola, the centricity always greater than one. So, we will take a square equal to one. That is why b square will be putting in this one, so b square will be three. So our equation of hyperbola, so our equation for hyperbola will be x square upon a square. That is one minus y square upon three equal to one. So if we put the tangent equation at a point, tangent at a point. That is x x one upon a square plus y sorry minus y y one upon b square equal to one. So here we know that x one is root two and and y one is root three. So we will put here so root two x upon a that is a square that is one root three y upon b square equal to three equal to one. So if you cross multiply it, you will get three root two minus x minus Root three y equal to three. So this is our equation for tangent. Now we can check the all the points which one is lying on this line. When you will check all the points, then you will see that two root two, comma three root two, three root three will be lie on it. We can check it here. Like if we put x equal to this, root two into root two will be two. Three into two six. Six into two. That will be. Twelve minus three root three, we can multiply three three into three nine, so it will be three, and this is equal to three. That's why B is our answer.